excited and honored. Those are the feelings experienced by the Karatekas that will represent South Africa in Mauritius. One of them is Katle Holisabe, who says playing karate has played a huge role in his life. But when we play a you see, so because of in this moment, like in all the anger, Mama Kava decided, okay, when all the sports be done karate, Mama will play karate. See, Rabba na discipline, but when all the anger, all those things, so get them more, get them more karate. Katleho's mother was quite hesitant to enroll him in karate as he was mischievous, thinking karate will make him more violent. I thought Katleho won't be able to do karate because actually she he was fighting with other kids more often. Then I thought maybe karate will be not uh, the sport that he can go through as it's a fight. And it took a bit of convincing for her to change her mind. When he came in, I sat down with him and explained the five mechanisms of karate, the discipline that we we implement in the little ones. So the parents, especially the mother, she couldn't believe that today I'll be standing here or her or Katako self explaining himself more about karate. Meanwhile, Katako's counterparts have high hopes and are also looking forward to making South Africa proud. And I feel excited and proud that I am going to present a, a that I'm going to stand for in South Africa in Mauritius. Mauritius, I'm going to build a profile. I'm hoping for a position three at least. I'm hoping to achieve great things, learn a few things there, come back as champions, obviously. The provincial government has committed to offer these Karatekas support. They must not suffer when we are here as government. And we are expected to support them and take full responsibility. Uh, as they depart and represent us as a province and also the country. This Karateka's hope is to make South Africa proud and bring home some medals. Masei Jimutlangwani, SABC News, Mahikeng.